Hello, we're here today in the 14th district in Paris and going to visit a lovely three bedroom apartment uh, which is located just uh, right behind me. This is the door. It's a very nice apartment because it's very large. It has a big corridor with a three uh, 14 square meters room and uh, a shared uh, toilet and bathroom and a shared kitchen. So I, I think this apartment is ideal for students uh, coming to Paris or studying Paris uh, who are single, uh, but also uh, professionals, young professionals who are coming to Paris. Uh, it's it's uh, really beautiful uh, and also it's located in the uh, very nice district. It's in the Rue d'Alésia. Rue d'Alésia is a street full of commerce, really all the services you need uh, from banks to bakeries, uh, flower shops and uh, uh, washing machine places, like everything really is here. Um, and also, actually, the 14th district has some other things, like it has a Montsouris Park. So, I think some 10 or 15 minutes walk from here, you can go to this very beautiful public park. Um, and also, very close to here, you have uh, the uh, public transportation with the line 4, uh, the subway station Alésia. So it's, I think the location is great and the apartment is very beautiful, um, but to be sure it's really a nice option for you, you have to check it out. We're going to visit one, only one bedroom because uh, the other two bedrooms are commonly uh, occupied by uh, tenants, uh, but they are kind of the same size from the bedroom we're going to see, so, and uh, the furniture is kind of similar too. So you're going to have a good idea, at least you're going to see the, the shared spaces of the apartment. So, Let's take a look. We're now on the fourth uh, floor uh, of this uh, very beautiful building. As you can see, we have this nice uh, stairway and, uh, and then we arrive right here. This is the door in front of the apartment we're about to visit. And uh, this is the door of our three bedroom apartment. This is a lovely apartment in the 14th district. So entering the apartment, we inside this uh, a big uh, corridor. As you can see, it's a very, very long corridor. Uh, right in the, uh, in the entrance, you already have a, a heating uh, a radiator here. Uh, and then on the right-hand side, we have this mirror with place to put your clothes and shoes and jackets and so on. So the first door here is a bedroom. Uh, we're not gonna be able to see this bedroom uh, right now because only uh, because there are still two tenants uh, in the apartment and only one room we're going to be able to visit. But what is important to say is that all three rooms have the exact same size and a very similar furniture. So, uh, I was, so here, the first thing on the corner is this uh, big door, which is a kind of a closet where we can put like an ironing board and uh, like cleaning products, the vacuum cleaner. And so it's a very big uh, closet shared by everyone. And it's quite uh, practical to have a um, uh, closet like that. And then continuing in the corridor, uh, we see on the left hand side this uh, door, which is the bathroom. We're gonna check out this uh, prison. And then on the right hand side is the door of the bedroom. We're going to visit the tenant just left the apartment and it's all pretty clean. So taking a look here, uh, we can see the room. It's a quite a beautiful room. Um, uh, as you can see, I think it's quite spacious, right? Um, let's start from uh, left to right. So here on the left hand side, we have this uh, uh, light and this uh, shelf is here. So it's kind of a bookshelf. Uh, and then we have this uh, standalone wardrobe. It has three doors. Um, on the top also we have some space here. Uh, so it's a lot of space. I think here we can put a lot of objects and uh, eventually even uh, above the uh, wardrobe we can put luggage for example. Uh, right here we have uh, space for to hang the clothes, uh, so jackets and t-shirts. And here uh, we have some uh, tree um, uh, storage space and then here we have some uh, three drawers which are this size. Uh, and let's take one of you here from this side. Um, so right here we have this uh, table, which is a desk, and uh, this chair, which is uh, quite beautiful. And this small carpet here, 
And right there is the uh, uh, sofa bed, it's a transformable sofa bed. I think it's quite big. Uh, then we have this side, this side, this corner of the room. We have this uh, uh, mirror, it's a big mirror. It's nice to have a mirror uh, on the room. And then finally, we can see there is this big radiator. So during the winter, uh, it's gonna be uh, a good temperature inside the room. Um, the windows are not double glazed. Um, but let me see. Yeah, I don't think they are double glazed. Um, but you you have this uh, this thing here which you can close, and this can help you um, uh, with the uh, with uh, the cold weather and also uh, cutting the sunlight. So that's the view you have from the room. As you can see, it's the internal courtyard. Uh, here you have this uh, little thing to. A hanger clothes if you want to dry them uh, here outside the room uh, so as you can see there's a lot of sunlight coming from that side and uh, uh, even though the sun is not uh, hitting the uh, window uh, directly I think actually window the, the room is quite luminous it's, it's pretty much okay for me um, so now we have seen the bedroom let's take a look on the bathroom which is just in front of the, the bedroom. So that's the door taking us to the bathroom. We have this light here and uh, then we can see from left to right we have a mirror and the sink and uh, this cabinet here. Uh, then we have this uh, radiator, this heating where you can hang our towels and clothes so we can dry them here. Um, then we have these two windows, uh, which can be opened. These casement windows. And right here, the washing machine. Uh, right, uh, so it's gonna be shared with, uh, this, this bathroom is gonna be shared with the two other tenants of the apartment. Then we have this uh, shower here, which is quite nice. Uh, as you can see, you have hot water and cold water. And this is a typical French shower. So that's it, that's our bathroom. Uh, let's take one last look before uh, taking a look at the rest of the apartment. So the last thing you're going to see is the um, a kitchen, which is right here. Uh, so the kitchen has this kind of door, which gives more space. Then you have on the left side uh, the sink, and you have uh, some four uh, cabinets here. So the cabinets have a lot of space. Uh, I, you can share it with your, with the other tenants with no problem because you have pretty much space enough to put all dishes and uh, glasses of everyone and you're not gonna lack space in here. So that's the sink. Down here you have more uh, storage, for pots and pans. And here more storage, as you can see. And here we have this drawer, which is quite big. Then on the other side we have a refrigerator with a freezer on the top. So it's quite spacious, as you can see. Um, right here we have this uh, gas heating, so that's that's what uh, hits the, the radiators and the, the water from the house. Um, here we have more cabinets and more cabinets. Then we have the stove with four hubs. I think it's a gas stove, as you can see. Um, then we have some more, more drawers, uh, more storage. And finally, we have this oven, which I guess is, it's kind of, it's actually an electric oven. I thought it would be a gas, but it's not a gas, it's an electric oven. So that's it. And uh, one last thing I'm gonna show you is the view from the window, which I think is quite beautiful. Um, as you can see here, we have this lovely uh, courtyard full of plants and then there's kind of a garden there. So it's actually a very nice view. You can see it's a, a pretty calm place. I can hear absolutely no noise. So um, very nice place. So that's it. Now we have seen the entire uh, apartment. Hope you enjoyed it. So that's the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed the apartment. I'm Pedro for Spot Home Paris. Thanks for watching. A bientôt, bye.